first thing you want to do is go to YouTube and get the link for on Nicole BB's YouTube. It should be in her description, and it's going to open in Safari. So you don't want it to open in Safari. So just copy the link, and then you want to open the app Puffin, which is just like a desktop browser, and you want to enter it in there. Then you want to paste it into the bar, and it'll come up like this. And you want to click download, and it should come up as a white page. Click this device, downloads, and you click it, and you can see keynotes there. And you want to open keynote. Then you should see it pop up. And I don't know how to install fonts into keynote, so if you know how to do it, do it. But I don't know how to do it, so I just did it with a different font. Then you want to click the little text and then you want to click the button at the top and you want to change the font because I really didn't like the Arial however you say it and I changed it to this font it looked kind of good but it's not like be this new or something like that and also sorry for the noise in the background my TV's on my sister's watching TV but I changed all of them to that font and then yeah you can type whatever you want to I'll show you how to do that in a second After that, you want to click on the tets, double click it, and then you can change the tets to anything you want. And you know, I just put Beauty by Journey because it's my channel name, not this channel, but my beauty channel. Then you want to click animate. This is for when you want to screen record it. You want to click animate and then click the little button that says wipe or whatever it, the building is. And then you want to click play at the top and it will play it. And then you're screen recording it. So later you can go back in Airshot and put it in QCAP Pro. And I'm about to show you guys that now in a different one that I did. So after you like you screen recorded it like I just showed you, you want to click the plus in QCAP Pro. And you can find the app that you can crop. I don't know if all of you guys have QCAP Pro, but just find an app that you can crop in. But then once you import, you want to scroll to the part where it started recording. And, you know, the whole process of clicking the tab to click animate and then play, it's going to show up. And you just want to clip it, like, right at the point where it starts to play. And when I meant split it, not clip it, but... And then you want to zoom in, or you can crop it, but when you crop stuff like you got Pro by your screen recording, it kind of takes a while. So, um, yeah, like it crashes and stuff for me. So you just want to zoom in, and here you go. And I didn't put any text because it was just for the video. So, yeah, that's how you do it. And you want to make sure that all the ends are cut off, like where it stops recording. So, like this, the white, you want to make sure you cut that part off, like completely, so your viewers don't see it in your green screen. If you don't understand something, tell me down below and I'll briefly explain it to you the best I can. So, yeah, I'm just going to be showing you guys over and over again what it looks like. Also, if you don't know who Nicole BBB is, I'll link her channel down below and I'm also linking the uh, video to how to get Keynote and iMovie for free.